In phacomulsification, intraoperative incision leakage can occur, especially after the withdrawal of a handpiece tip. Without the support of irrigation usually with an ophthalmic viscoelastic device, or OVD, intraoperative leakage could lead to the transient collapse of the anterior chamber, changes in which can be subtle when viewing through the surgical microscope and potentially neglected. With the help of an external slit illuminator, we now can observe the anterior chamber collapse and found substantial forward movement of the posterior capsule and iris. Moreover, after the final removal of the OVD with irrigation or aspiration, forward movement of the intraocular lens can sometimes occur. The posterior capsule or intraocular lens could even contact the corneal endothelium. We propose to apply a downward pressure on the incision using a cotton swab immediately after the withdrawal of the handpiece tip for about 30 seconds, called swab pressing. If this simple technique could be applied intraoperatively, it may not only seal the incision instantly but also help to prevent anterior chamber collapse and related damages without injecting a solution to hydrate the stroma. We compare the efficacy of this technique with stromal hydration in preventing the incision leakage after the final removal of the OVD within a randomized clinical trial design using the proportion of closed incisions assessed by intraoperative optical coherence tomography as the primary outcome.